Is it the right time to make a move with Amazon stock? In this video, we will delve deeper into Amazon. Our initial report was released on our website on Monday, November 13, 2023. Today, we are here to provide you with an even more comprehensive analysis. Make sure to subscribe, like, and enable notifications to stay updated on our latest analysis. Staying informed is crucial to making well-informed investment decisions. Take your trading decisions to the next level by trying out our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Harness the power of artificial intelligence and gain access to free price predictions and in-depth analysis for any of the 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please keep in mind that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. As of October 30, 2023, our system has identified Amazon as a buy candidate, with a score of 1.29. Now, let's dive into the performance of the stock during this period. Over the specified time frame, the stock has gained 7.44%. This translates to an average daily return of 0.68% since it was designated as a buy candidate. The stock is currently in the upper part of a wide and falling trend in the short term. This presents a potential selling opportunity for short-term traders, as we can expect a reaction back towards the lower part of the trend. However, if the stock breaks up at the top trend line at $143.51, it may indicate a slower falling rate and could be the first sign of a trend shift. Looking at the three-month trend, there is a potential minus 2.08% change over the next three months, with a possible return ranging between minus 18.28% and minus 1.45%. On the other hand, the 12-month trend suggests a 59.68% change over the next year, with a potential return ranging from 37.01% to 73.36%. This means that the stock price could range from $195.37 to $247.19 after one year. Our latest daily update for Amazon brings the headline, Amazon stock price decreases by 0.676% on Monday. On the last day, which was Monday, November 13, 2023, the Amazon stock price went down by 0.676%, falling from $143.56 to $142.59. Throughout the trading day, the stock fluctuated between a low of $140.67 and a high of $143.23, experiencing a 1.82% change. It's worth noting that the stock has risen in 7 out of the last 10 days and has increased by 7.44% over the past 2 weeks. The decrease in volume along with the stock is actually a positive sign, as volume should follow the stock's trend. Specifically, the trading volume decreased by 14 million shares on the last day, with a total of 34 million shares being bought and sold, amounting to approximately $4.89 billion. Looking at the stock's performance over the past 52 weeks, the highest price reached was $145.86, while the lowest price was $81.43. Currently, the price is 2.24% or $3.27 below the 52-week high, and 89.08% or $1,162.61 below the all-time high on January 15, 2018, when the stock reached $1,305.20. Analyst Ratings On Friday, October 27, 2023, Morgan Stanley upgraded Amazon to an overweight, grade and maintained a hold action. On the same day, Oppenheimer also upgraded Amazon to an outperform, grade and maintained a hold action. Goldman Sachs gave Amazon a buy, grade and maintained a hold action. Telsey Advisory upgraded Amazon to an outperform, grade and maintained a hold action. On Monday, October 23, 2023, Bank of America Securities gave Amazon a buy, grade and maintained a hold action. Amazon stock has received a general rating of strong buy from analysts. The P-E ratio and price to book are both rated as strong buy. However, when it comes to return on investment, the analysts have given the stock a rating of neutral. Today, we'll be discussing the signals indicating the performance of Amazon stock. Let's dive in.
The Amazon stock is currently showing buy signals from both short and long-term moving averages, which is a positive indicator for the stock's future performance. Additionally, there's a general buy signal from the relation between these two signals, where the short-term average is above the long-term average. In case of downward corrections, the stock is likely to find support at the $141.41 and $131.20 levels. However, if the stock breaks below these levels, sell signals will be issued. On the other hand, there's a buy signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD, indicating a positive trend. It's important to note that some negative signals have also been observed, which may have an impact on the stock's near short-term development. Furthermore, a sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Friday, November 10, 2023, resulting in a minus 0.676% decrease. It's expected that the stock will continue to fall until a new bottom pivot is found. However, it's worth mentioning that the volume fell along with the price during the last trading day, which reduces the overall risk as volume should follow the price movements. In the long-term chart, the stock had a golden star signal on Monday, February 13, 2023. This rare combination occurs when the short-term moving average, the long-term moving average, and the price line meet in a special way. Historically, such combinations have often led to significant gains for the stock in question. In this video, I'll be sharing some interesting signals that you might find useful for your trading strategies. Let's start with the moving average convergence divergence, which is currently showing a buy signal. Another signal to consider is the pivots, which indicated a sell signal two days ago. The Bollinger Bands are showing a buy signal five days ago. Looking at the short-term moving average, it gave a buy signal 13 days ago. Similarly, the long-term moving average also provided a buy signal 12 days ago. Considering the relation between the short and long moving averages, we observed a buy signal 9 days ago. Now, let's analyze the 12-month chart and see what it reveals. The short moving average on the 12-month chart gave a buy signal 12 days ago. Similarly, the long-term moving average on the 12-month chart also indicated a buy signal 12 days ago. Analyzing the relation between the short and long moving averages on the 12-month chart, we saw a buy signal 2 days ago. Remember to visit our page at stockinvest.us if you want to explore more signals. Let's talk about support, risk, and stop loss for Amazon. When it comes to support, Amazon has found it in the form of accumulated volume at $140.39. This level could present a buying opportunity as we can expect the stock to react positively when this support is tested. Moving on to risk, Amazon tends to have average movements during the day. With good trading volume, the risk is considered to be medium. Taking a closer look at recent performance, the stock had a $2.56 difference between its highest and lowest points in the last day, representing a 1.82% change. Over the past week, the stock has shown a daily average volatility of 1.98%. Before we discuss the potential trading levels for Amazon, let's take a moment to go over some important fundamental data. First, let's talk about the price to earnings ratio, or PE ratio. This ratio compares a company's current share price to its per share earnings. A high P.E. ratio may indicate that the stock is overvalued or that investors expect significant growth in the future. Moving on, the next earnings report for Q4 2023 is scheduled for February 1, 2024. Analysts' consensus estimates for this report stand at $0.760. It's important to keep an eye on these numbers as they can have a significant impact on stock prices. Today, we'll be discussing potential day trading levels for Amazon stock. If we see an upward trend, the first resistance level for Amazon is at $143.10. If you're not already invested, it might be wise to wait for this level to be surpassed before entering a position. And for those who already hold the stock, this could be a level worth considering for swing trading. On the downside, Amazon faces its first support level at $140.39. If this support level holds, it could present a good opportunity to enter the market, anticipating a rebound. According to multiple analyst sources, Amazon has a strong buy rating. Now, let's delve into some recent insider trades. On November 2, 2023, 
Solipsky Adam sold 500 shares of common stock, valued at 1 cent per share. On November 3, 2023, Solipsky Adam sold another 500 shares of common stock, valued at 1 cent per share. On November 1, 2023, Harrington Douglas J sold 4,000 shares of common stock, valued at 1 cent per share. On October 30, 2023, Bezos Jeffrey P. sold 122,223 shares of common stock, valued at 1 cent per share. On October 31, 2023, Bezos Jeffrey P. sold 428,415 shares of common stock, valued at 1 cent per share. Based on the 100 most recent insider trades, the insider power ratio is calculated to be negative at minus 83.185. In the last 100 trades, insiders purchased a total of 183,944 shares and sold 2,145,040 shares. We recommend setting the stop loss at $137.03, which represents a decrease of 3.9%. This particular stock exhibits moderate daily movements, resulting in a medium level of risk. A sell signal was identified from a pivot top that occurred just one day ago. Is Amazon stock a good buy? Despite the stock being in a falling trend, there are several positive short-term signals. This suggests that the current level may present a buying opportunity, with a fair chance for the stock to perform well in the short term. After carefully analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day, our systems have determined that the current price is overvalued. When trading begins on Tuesday, November 14th, we anticipate Amazon to open down by dash $0.427 and start trading at $142.16. Before we dive into today's topic, it's important to remember that trading comes with a high risk of losing money. We strongly recommend consulting a financial advisor before making any buying or selling decisions. Please note that StockInvest.us is not the sole basis for your investment choices. By accessing and utilizing this information, you acknowledge and accept full responsibility for your own investment decisions. We'd love to hear your thoughts on our current view of the stock. Share your opinion in the comments below. What are your target goals for this stock? Remember to like and subscribe to stay updated with our latest content. Our team at Stock Invest wishes you successful trading and a wonderful day.